hi guys welcome to my channel today i'll be showing you how i made this delicious fried rice so guys please before we dive right in remember to like and subscribe to my channel thank you So before I start, I would like to spice up my chicken. I added in salt, um, seasoning cubes. I used chicken seasoning cubes. I added in my thyme. I also added in my curry powder. I added my ginger and garlic powder. I added some rosemary and I also added in vegetable oil. After adding them up, I had to give a quick stir. I mixed to make sure that everything incorporated with my chicken so after mixing thoroughly this is what my chicken looks like then after this i also decided to cover with my foil if you have a clean frame you can as well decide to do this i covered this up for at least one hour to allow my chicken marinate very well after one hour, I opened up and yes, it still looks this way. Please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much. After that, in my pan, I added in my seasoned and marinated chicken. After that, I added in some water. For the start, I usually like to add either no water or just little water. I added in a little water just so that this could boil and cook very well. I allowed to cook for at least 10 minutes and this is what it looks like now. And after this I added in some more water because I'll be needing enough of this chicken stock in preparing our rice. So after 5 minutes, I opened up and this is what it looks like. So yeah, it's cooked, well cooked and now I have enough chicken stock for my rice. So in my heated pan, I added in my oil, I chopped some onion and I added this in. I'm going to be using this oil to fry my chicken but before that, I really wanted to infuse this oil with my onion so i allowed this onion to fry for at least two minutes just to make sure that my oil has a little bit of taste before frying the chicken then this is me saving out the oil trying so hard to save out the um onion rather after saving this onion from the oil i started introducing my chicken back into this hot oil to fry for at least another 10 minutes so i fried this chicken until it turned golden brown and then in my pot i added in some oil yeah this oil looks this way because this was the same oil i used in frying my chicken after that i introduced my chopped onion i fried also and after that i also added in my dried pepper please you can use fresh pepper if you have i didn't use fresh pepper because i did not have any at home after that i added in some thyme some curry powder and then i added in my chicken cube after this i gave a quick stir and i allowed this to fry very very well trust me you would want your rice to be tasty after frying i added in my meat stock to this gravy you'd want to add your meat stock first just so that you can make adjustments in your seasoning if maybe you need to add more salt or not after this i added in my washed rice please note that when making fried rice is not necessary to parboil your rice you can wash or soak in hot water wash till it's crystal clear after this i give a quick mix just incorporated my rice with this sauce i gave this a very quick mix and yeah i added in some 
water that would be enough and able to cook this rice we also don't want our rice to cook very soft so we need to be very careful with the amount of water we're adding in after mixing i tasted for salt and i made adjustments where necessary i covered this and allowed to cook and yeah our rice is ready and perfect just the way we want it to look and this is what our rice looks like then again in my pan i introduced my onion i started frying again that's why it's called fried rice because i think a whole lot of things just has to be fried i fried again i added in my curry powder and i think i also added in some seasoning cubes which was also done out of the clip so um after adding my curry powder i stirred very well and after that i just added in my mixed vegetables this is the favorite part of fried rice and this is one thing i love so much about fried rice i love the, i love the veggies i love the colors like everything just looks appetizing at this point so i fried and fried and fried <laughs> So now back to our pot of rice, we are going to add our veggies into this pot of rice and we're just going to give this a quick mix. Now you just have to mix gently and swiftly. You don't have to start turning as if you're making ever. You just have to mix it this way. Make sure the veggies are incorporating very well with this rice. Like, I so much love this part of my fried rice. Like, I really do love this part of making fried rice because at this point, you can just see the beauty of this meal. And yes, our fried rice is ready. Please, I know you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel.